market, but what can do with my DOD stuff? But today I've come on the Mercy Ferry. So, and also it's my birthday. So it's go on the ferry across the Mersey on my birthday. Tak, 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 I'm actually going to the song. But, it, yeah, it's a pretty it's like a river stop tour, so it's 50 minutes, 30 minutes to one side of the river and 30 minutes, 20 minutes to the other side, something like that. But, well, we wanted to come on this way for a while, so it's really, really good. I'm, I'm looking forward to setting set off. And hopefully it'll be a good trip. There's been a passenger service across the Mersey since the 12th century made famous by the song Ferry Across the Mersey by Jerry and the Pacemakers the Mersey Ferry has become synonymous and I was really looking, looking forward to going onto the ferry and I stayed to the bottom deck because it was quite windy and I didn't want to get too windswept but a lot of the passengers did go upstairs, but it meant that I could have a nice, relaxed walk crossing the Mersey. And luckily, the weather was just right. This service that I went on was a, a river cruise, so it, was a, it started at Liverpool at, at the Jerry Martin Terminal, and it would be 20 minutes to get to. See you coming to the other side, and then half an hour back. So it was kind of like a panoramic uh, trip. Usually, it takes ten minutes to get there and back, but because this is a river cruise, it takes longer so we could see the sights. The first site is Bramall Dock, which is where Everton Football Club are going to be playing in a couple of years' time, and this is one of the shipyards because Liverpool's synonymous for chip building. Now this is a panoramic view of the Mersey. So they've got the Royal Dock to the right and in the distance the city. And to the left is the Wirral and Birkenhead. And that was for years the main way to cross the Mersey was by this ferry. Here's a closer look at the Liverpool skyline. Then in the distance you can see the two spires of the Live Building, which is probably one of the most iconic buildings in, in Liverpool. As we swing towards that the other side of the Mers, which is towards the Wirral, which is where Birkenhead is, which is quite an industrial place and also very to Ireland, depart from Birkenhead. Of course, a couple of years ago I went to Ireland and we sailed from Birkenhead. And in front of us is the Seacombe Terminal, where the Mersey Ferry docks. After picking some passengers up at Seacombe, we went back onto the Mersey. In 2008, a new arena was built in Liverpool to coincide with it being named European Capital of Culture. So that is the grey building on the right, and then to the left of that is the red brick buildings, which is the Royal Albert Dock, and that was disused in the 80s, but it's been restored, so then there's several museums there. And in front here is the Liverpool Museum, which is the building with a big window, the grey building. And that's right in front of the, I've got the library building, which is synonymous and with the two towers and the live birds on top. And the modern building to the left is the Jerry Marsden 
fairy terminal of course named after the lead singer Jerry and the Pacemakers who sadly died in 2021 but that is where we'll be docking and coming to the end of a good trip on the Mersey Ferry Just coming in to dock, it's been a really good uh, trip up. I had to stay in, indoors because I think it's a bit windy if I went outside. I'm, I've been completely wind swept, but lots of people have gone upstairs. But I didn't want to get wind swept. But really good, you know, really enjoyed it. Something I've wanted to do for quite a long time. It's very good. Learn about the history of the boat and the river in Liverpool itself, and just the opportunity to see Liverpool from a lot of different angles. So, yeah, I'm really good, I'm really pleased, and it's been good, and certainly enjoyed coming I recommend it definitely. So, thanks for watching this, and I'll, thanks for watching all the recent videos, and there'll be a lot more to come. So, like that one, I love that though. I'll see you on the next one.